Hello, cookbook friends. This is Carrie with Cookbook Divas. And I felt like grabbing a copy of Milk Bar All About Cake by Christina Tosi and looking through it with you. And it's super pink, so I dressed for the occasion. Here's what it looks like on the back. So if you're new to this channel, we take cookbooks and look through them on video. We haven't peeked inside other than doing a quick flip through reel over on Instagram. So let's take a look and check it out. I love cake. And we're off to a good start with big colorful photos of delicious food. All about cake. With Courtney McBroom, photographs by Gabrielle Stable and Mark Ebold or Ibold. It is from Clarkson Potter Publishers, one of our favorite cookbook publishers. Ooh, cakes. I want to check out the table of contents. We start off with the truth. We move on to TMI, something I'm very good at giving people. And then we then we move on to bunts, pounds, and a fluffy little cake from heaven, whatever that means. Sounds cute. Then it's time for hot cakes. Then sheet cakes for the masses. I can tell she has a sense of humor. Cupcakes, if you must. Oh, what's wrong with cupcakes? No, it's true. I got sick of the cupcake trend of the of the two thousand early two thousands. Cake truffles make the world go round. Get fancy with layer cakes. Ooh, veganity i.e. vegan cakes, and then acknowledgements. I'm going to grab some glasses. Pink, of course. That would be scissors. I'm glad I didn't just shove that in my eyes. <laughs> okay, let's take a look at this cookbook. It's hard to see with my ring light shining in my face. Okay, there she is. The truth. Here's the things that bummed her out about cake. Cake flavors are dull and boring. Cake is usually overbaked to make it sturdy enough to be layered or topped. Cake is usually just one soft, spongy bite. Why take the time to make cake so beautiful on the outside if it's just a snooze fest when you bite in? <laughs> okay. TMI, the goods that you need. Bananas have to be ripe. Chile, oh, excuse me, citric or ascorbic acid, corn powder, extracts, flour recommendations, salt. Purses, huh? Purees. <laughs> I know how to read. I swear I went to college and graduated. Here's the wares. Things you need. Baking pans. Okay, I'm not going to have that many pans because I don't have a commercial kitchen in my home. Measuring cups and spoons. Microwave, la la la. Ooh. The techniques. Blooming gelatin. Get it right or do it twice. Whoa, not sure what's going on here. Okay, the life lessons, yes. Here we go, the first chapter. Bunts, pounds, fluffy little cake from heaven. First recipe of the book, lemon poppy seed bunt cake and a lemon honey glaze. Next up, we have a raspberry bunt cake. You would think you would have a picture of the first cake in the book with the first recipe, but apparently no. Okay. Oh, step-by-step -step photos. That's very reassuring because if I made something that looked like this, I'd start panicking that it wasn't supposed to look like that. And it is. Ooh, a cherry cola bunt cake. That is so cute. I'm going to have to skip over a lot of these because I can't show you the whole book. It's not fair. Pistachio bunt cake. I love pistachios. And they seem to be super in right now. A mint julep bunt cake with bourbon mint soak. Mmm. Nice for the Kentucky Derby. A molasses rye bunt cake, some step-by-step -step photos, some pictures of some baking supplies. Sesame pound cake, wow. Rhubarb elderflower pound cake, yum. I need to move on to another chapter though because I can't just show you every possible page. That would be rude. A burnt miso pound cake, banana green curry cake, wow, those are inventive. Okay, hot cakes, not sure what's going on there. She says, honestly, my biggest beef with cake these days is how come no one eats their cake hot? Oatmeal, apple, brown sugar, microwave, mug cake. Ah, oh, that kind of hot cake. Okay, and there she is eating it and teaching us to make green apple matchsticks. Mint chocolate chip molten microwave mug cake. And creamsicle crockpot cake. And... 
banana chocolate peanut butter crock pot cake. I've never made a cake in a crock pot. I should try it. Apple cider donut crock pot pudding. Now we're in sheet cakes for the masses. I don't usually do sheet cakes, but I know they're popular. Step-by-step -step photos. Every milk bar sheet cake follows the same formula. Okay. Here's a baller birthday sheet cake. Cute confetti. Inside out chocolate yellow sheet cake. Inside out? Oh, wow. I would have thought that was lemon bars, and I would have been wrong. Corn and blueberry sheet cake. That sounds amazing. Okay. Let's get to the next chapter. Cupcakes, if you must. I must. Because they're cute. Okay. White album cupcakes. <laughs> lemon meringue cupcakes. They don't look super lemony, but they probably are. A super colorful page I'm not going to show you. Key lime pie cupcakes. They're not green. Because they're made with graham cracker. Oh, that's the graham cracker cupcakes from the same page. Okay. So key lime pie cupcakes, we don't have a picture of. That was very confusing. But they're teaching you to make key lime whipped cream and strawberry coconut cupcakes. There, the picture matches the recipe. Okay. Whew. This is exhausting. No one hates on a chocolate cupcake. I would because there's too many chocolate chips on top of the frosting, but I don't care for chocolate that much, so I'm just being picky. German chocolate cupcakes. Oh, my brother would love those. Okay. How about we get to the next chapter, cake truffles. Something I'm not personally a fan of, but I have some friends that love them. And look how cute and festive the birthday truffles are. Uh, chocolate malt cake truffles. And some pretty truffles. Apple pie cake truffles. Ooh, clever. Now, I think we're getting to another chapter. No, because here's popcorn cake truffles. <laughs> Okay, strawberry lemon cake truffles. Am I in another? Nope, I'm pretzel cake truffles. Okay, that's not what they look like. That's pretzels. What do they look like? Nope. Hey, I need a picture. Okay, they must be, nope. Pretzel sand, is that them? They don't look like pretzels. I'm very confused. Okay, mint cookies and cream cake truffles mint liquid cheesecake. I'm not sure what this is a picture of. Chocolate sand. I think I wish they had just one recipe with each picture. Liam's tough cookie cake truffles. Let's get out of the cake truffle chapter. But I do want to show you the croquembouche. That's very, very awesome. Okay. Layer cakes. The milk bar layer cake formula will come in handy. Decor, frosting cake, filling, crumbs, frosting soap, etc. Key lime pie layer cake. Again, it's not green, which is good because that means there's no artificial coloring, I guess. I just always have a green one. So that's breaking my brain, but in a good way. Dolce du leche layer cake. Looks very similar to the key lime one in color. Hmm. Okay, and popcorn layer cake. And pineapple upside down layer cake. These are all looking pretty similar, but this one has some cute pink in there. And that is a lot of layers. Wow. German chocolate Jimbo layer cake. Pretty cool. We're getting to the end of the book. There's a whole bunch of layer cakes. Oh my gosh. And then techniques, piping, acknowledgements, etc. That was Milk Bar All About Cake. I think I was a little confused in some of the places, and I'm not a fan of cake truffles, so I may give this one away, but I had a lot of fun looking through it, and I hope it was helpful for you deciding if you were going to add it to your library or not. And be sure to check out more of our cookbook reviews on YouTube. Cookbookdivas.com is our website. We have a podcast where we talk about cookbooks. We post cookbook news to Facebook and cookbook reels to Instagram. And sometimes we're on Pinterest, but not usually. And thanks so much for watching.